Hello everyone, just want to go ahead and do a quick video. Uh, this is a Ask Nurse Laurel vlog and I had come across a video that I found very interesting. It was called, uh, it was from uh, Simply Shimmery Scraps coffee sleeve mini album binding tutorial and uh, she is awesome so if you haven't checked out her video go on over subscribe and uh, check out her projects totally totally awesome and um, anyways well in her pro in her uh, project video the tutorial she had said that she had used something called Tyvek so my questioning is like what is Tyvek what is that so I looked it up actually I went to Wikipedia Tyvek is actually a brand of flash spun high density polyethylene fibers a synthetic material that is named it, the name is registered trademark of DuPont The material is very strong and difficult to tear but can be cut with scissors I'm reading this from Wikipedia, Wikipedia. Or, uh, or, or knife. Water vapor can pass through Tyvek. It's highly breathable, but not liquid water. So the material it's, lends itself to a, a variety of applications. You can use it for envelopes, car covers, air and water intrusion barriers like house wrap, uh, under, si under house siding, labels, wristbands, mycology, and graphics. So that's pretty interesting. Now just for the history of Tyvek, uh, it is a non-woven product consisting of spun spun bond olefin fiber and it was discovered in 1955 by DuPont registered uh, researcher excuse me Jim White who saw poly polythylene fluff coming out of a pipe in a DuPont experiment lab. and I don't know if I'm saying that right that word um, I'm doing the best I can there it was a tr it was then trademarked in 1965 and was first induced for commercial purposes in April 1967 hmm it's pretty interesting and uh, the non-directional fibers it's called plex plexi filaments are first spun and then bonded together by heat and pressure without binders so Tyvek is actually manufactured in Spruance plant in Richmond Virginia and Contran Luxembourg hmm very interesting so you're probably wondering what it looks like well this is what Holly or the uh, Tyvek looks like <laughs> <laughs> You're going to laugh. Like an envelope. It's pretty interesting. But this is like some pretty great stuff. And I usually get these envelopes and uh, send out stuff in them. Um, and then when I get stuff, like if I've ordered something, I just recycle. And uh, sorry about that. Let me go ahead and show you. Um, but in her video, she's, that's, she said that's what she used to bind her coffee. Um, coffee sleeve mini album. This is a mini album that I'm actually working on. It's not all the way put together, but if you can see, this is what I what I use here. It's this priority mail envelope. And this is something that was sent to me and then I just recycled after I got some some magazines. Um, I ordered um, um, Magnolia magazine with a gift card that I received for my birthday, so I just saved the envelope and then I upcycled. So that is what Tyvex is. So I thought that was just a very informative little thing. And uh, so I hope that for today's vlog, <laughs> you found it interesting too. So uh, yeah, if you just save your envelopes that you get when people send you stuff, or you can, I guess, pick them up at the post office. I don't know if your post office will charge you for the uh, DuPont Tyvek um, envelopes. But you can actually order online. And I looked at, they are kind of pricey, so. Anyway, so I felt, hope that you liked the video. I just wanted to share what I found out. I was like, oh, that's pretty interesting. And have a great day. Thanks for watching.